Hello everyone, my name is Colin Gordon. I'm a lead application engineer here with Schweitzer Engineering Laboratories in the Wired Communications Group. And today I get to talk to you about one of my favorite products, the SEL3620 Ethernet Security Gateway. Now the Security Gateway product line features both the 3620, which is a 19-inch 1U rack mount device, as well as its little brother, the SEL3622 Security Gateway, which is a DIN rail mount device. They're both security gateway appliances that are meant to be in harsh environments such as substations, and they both have secure VPN as well as deny by default firewall and routing capabilities. The two favorite features I like to talk about are the password management capability and the authentication proxy piece. The password management capability is where the 3620 or 22 can go out to and interact with a critical device and manage the passwords on those devices. The second piece is the authentication proxy. And this allows you as an engineer or a technician to authenticate securely to the SEL 3620 using your corporate credentials, maybe connecting back to an Active Directory database or some sort of radius server, uh, such as using multi-factor authentication and allow you then, based on your authorizations, to interact with a relay if you have the privileges to do that. Finally, the 3620 and 22 are going to bring accountability into your substation as well. Every time you log in and perform an action on a critical device, it's going to be recording all the actions that you take, all the commands that you send to that device, from what IP address, at what time of day, and it records it back to your individual user account. So the 3620 and the SEL 3622 are really meant to help bolster our end users' NERC SIP compliance efforts.